who should be the next head coach of the U.S. men's national team? Yeah, loaded question. Uh, I don't want that question, frankly, answered until probably after next summer's World Cup when you have the full pool of candidates at your disposal, assuming you don't have somebody lined up already that makes perfect sense. I, I understand you don't want to waste too long in trying to rebuild this program back up. You want to make sure it's done with the right person, male or female. Um, and the other point is there is a U.S. soccer presidential election coming up in February. Sunil Gulati, the longtime U.S. soccer president, has said he's still going to run. Some candidates are starting to finally trickle in. Um, I, I feel it's a lot like if you have an athletic director on the way out, that person should not be hiring the next head coach of a major program. Um, if Sunil Gulati is not the man to continue to lead U.S. soccer, I don't want him making a head coach selection right now. Um, the beauty of the selection process is that there are a couple really strong candidates right here in the United States. Tab Ramos, who coaches the under-20 national team, has wonderful pedigree as a player as well, was one of the best ever to wear the red, white, and blue. Peter Vermes, you could say the same thing for him. He's now coaching in Kansas City with Sporting KC in MLS. I think he's another great candidate here on our shores already. But you know, there's there's a lot of intrigue and interest in being the head coach of a national team, particularly one of of the value of the United States of America. And, and leading this federation for the long haul to make that pick. And that pick is going to have a long list of candidates. People are going to be calling in to say, please, please consider me. And here's my resume because this is what I can do for this type of program.